Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. My name is Layla. If you're one of my OG subscribers or just one of my viewers who likes watching the channel but hasn't subscribed, welcome back. I hope you like this video. Enjoy it. Follow me on Instagram at the same handle at just one SV and we're just going to get right into it. So this is my Michael Kors Manhattan bag that I purchased a couple months back, not too long ago. I did do um, kind of a reveal with my sister. So if you haven't checked that video out, you definitely should. And then of course I did another little video because I got this gorgeous charm here from at Lady Sin Charms. I'll be sure to link her Instagram down below. Um, she's sort of kind of <laughs> trying to retire on making as many beads and stuff, but she loves doing this specific color pattern like the iridescent or the oil slick or whatever you want to call it, kind of rainbow, really busy charm. So definitely something you should reach out to her if you like and interested in checking out. I did post a quick little reel because it just looks so pretty in the sun yesterday. So I do have her dressed with this, but again, this is the Michael Kors Manhattan bag this is how she looks in case you haven't seen that video and I did wear her with blue jeans yesterday on purpose because I wanted to see what would happen I'm not sure if you guys can see it here but there's a little bit of color transfer so I wanted to be open and transparent about that I am one who does not baby my bags of course I don't want them dirty and nasty I do take care of them clean them as needed um, but I did want to see how she would truly react so I did not like pre-treat her or spray her with anything or anything like that I'm gonna take a little bit of soap and water and try to wash that off um, with a clean rag after the video but I did want to do a quick little what's in my bag video of her before I take my things out of her I did one of those kind of mom <laughs> daughter auntie little mini shopping day it was really more for me to do returns um, yesterday I had ordered some stuff from Vicky's just because they had a little sale and I wanted to kind of just see some of it some of the stuff they don't have in store so I did purchase a couple of things but anyway so she has a little opening like this you open her up like so and you're inside so the charm is huge so of course it kind of moves it way it little way halfway in the bag and halfway on the side so you kind of have to maneuver a little bit but I don't mind because she is big and gorgeous so this is a quick little overview the only thing that's missing is my cell phone I had it in my back pocket for the most part but I also had it slipped in this little front pocket um, some of the time while we were in the mall as well so this is a quick little overview of what she looks like and so basically in the front pocket I do have a little slip of paper because I ran out to Publix and um, the Dollar Tree this morning so just a quick little shopping list this is just a piece of happy planner paper that I just pulled off and cut um, in this front little um, slip pocket that it has on this side I just have my most recent and sorry about the noise you guys I'm trying to prop it up a little bit and I have it on this little like I don't know like jewelry container box thing that I keep my little YouTube business cards in but anyway um, so I just have a little Bath and Body Works coupon. I just pulled it off the little flyer that you get it in and slipped it in there because I know Bath and Body Works is in the mall. So just in case I wanted to go in there, I wanted to have my actual coupon with me. Um, this is the wallet that I had shown on the video where I showed the... Um, the charm from Cindy um, just because I wanted to show you guys what I did pick out to go with the bag so this is that infamous coach medium zip wallet that I had shown in another video where I showed all the ones that I had in my collection so this is the newest baby I got after I got this bag I wanted something to match and I knew that coach came out with the um, neon line so I should have brought another one over here to show you guys inside just in case you're new to my channel but I'll try to link that video down below but I'm not going to show you guys the inside since I do have all of my cards in there and people are crazy on the internet shit is getting worse than it was so not doing that um, but essentially it has credit card slots a coin zip slot a slip pocket and then of course the large back pocket for like your um, bills and you know money or papers or whatever you want to slip in there so then in the back zipper pocket I just put my lady products just kind of loosen by themselves and zipped it up so I just have two liners and a wipe in there no need to pull that out on camera and then I just have some peppermints I took a lip gloss with me just in case we went to like my mom's house or something afterwards I had a full face of makeup on yesterday so I did take my lip gloss with me I have my airpods I had my infamous chapstick <laughs> and then I had my hand sanitizer instead of having it hanging on the outside since the bag is so tiny I just had it tucked in here um, then I did bring my taser with me I was strapped and I also had my um, what do you call it pepper spray <laughs> in my holster and then I have my rewetting drops for my contacts I don't know if you guys remember me talking about this pen if you're not new here and you saw that video this is the pen gem um Jesus Christ I forgot this pen's name already they have so many names so much to keep up with but anyway the colors are so pretty it goes so well um with the kind of oil slick hardware so I did toss this in here this is a twist pen if you're new to pen gem so it's not gonna open up and write by itself like it was accidentally clicked or something like that as always gotta have a lotion so this one's the snowy morning 
Then I am back in my press on game. So I do have my pink kiss gel nail glue in case one popped off. My daughter was driving. She's 15 now, 16 this summer. Um, and now that sports have died down and all the extras, we did go ahead and get her permit recently. She, I've been pushing her to do it since her 15th birthday last summer. But she's been like, no, I don't want to right now. I'm in sports. That's too much studying. I don't want to blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so she drove. <laughs> so she drove, but I took my keys anyway, just in case. Because if you guys remember, I do keep my license in here. If you're new here, this is a Louis Vuitton six key holder. I have it hot stamped with SB in the corner. Um, so I did take my keys with, you know, the house key and all the other keys inside of it just in case we need it. And like I said, my license and my carry license are both in there. Um, then I just have a little pack of tissues. You never know when you'll need to blow your snacks in the store. And then some brush strips. I always like to have those, especially with eating out, wearing masks, having everything you just ate contained to your face. <laughs> so I'll definitely like to keep those now. And that's it. She is completely empty. So I did want to empty her out. Um, I did want to show you guys, you know, what's in her because I am terrible about that, y'all. I'll be like, okay I'm ready to put all my stuff back in my Neverfull or back in whatever bag I'm carrying and take it out of the little crossbody that I might have carried for just the weekend and then I completely forget about it and then after literally after I switch all the shit over to the next bag I'm like you idiot like in my Ren and Snippy voice you should have done what's in my bag in that one uh oh your chain stuck a little bit okay i'm like you should have done what's in my bag in that one before you switched out of it but now it's too late you've already moved all the stuff and i'd be so lazy y'all i'd be like i'm not about to pack the bag just to do a video we're not doing that i did do that for you guys before with that never full gm after i traveled to puerto rico but i'm trying to get better at showing you guys <laughs> what's in my bag or what i used it for whatever um before I move all the stuff out of it. So trying to get on point with that. So I did set up my tripod and my camera so that I could have both hands to show you guys that. But I absolutely love this bag. She is so cute. She got so many compliments along with my personal nails, of course. Um, she was absolutely adored. She's very easy to carry. Um, I did carry her kind of handle a little bit. I put her on my arm to like touch stuff in the store. And then of course I had a crossbody like as we were, you know, walking from one store to the next. My daughter had a couple returns as well or exchanges, I should say. Um, so yeah, she is a beauty. If you can get your hands on her from the Michael Kors outlet you totally should I don't know if they still have it um, but I would definitely look if you do like the bag the hardware is just so damn pretty it's adorable even at Publix this morning when I was checking out I swear you guys buying chicken these days is out of control like it's sold out everywhere but I did get what I needed from Publix this morning um, but even the cashier was like oh my god your bag and charm is adorable where'd you get that so definitely a showstopper and a conversation starter so I won't hold y'all just want to show what's in my bag I hope you guys have been enjoying the channel like I said, if you're new and you haven't subscribed, you should definitely go ahead and hit that little subscribe button and that bell. And I will see all you gorgeous beauties in the next video. Bye.